Hi, I'm Tim Van Milligan from Apogee Components. Um, I'm going to take a little break from making our normal how-to videos this week and talk a little bit about what my day is like here at Apogee Components because a lot of people are kind of interested. What's it like to run a rocket company? Um, as you can see, this is my office. I'm, I'm not in the studio this time, so here I'm, I'm here at my desk. Uh, on my desk, you see I have my uh, laptop computer. This is kind of where I spend probably 80% of my day is on the computer, either writing the newsletter or answering customer emails, uh, talking on the phone when customers uh, have questions. Um, my desk is, is not usually this clean. Um, usually it has more paperwork on it. Uh, I took a little bit off of it just so it's not so cluttered today. Um, I always have some kind of rocket stuff on my desk. Like uh, uh, today I have these little plastic rivets for high power rockets. Because uh, this is a really cool item and I'd, someday I'd like to make this a product. Um, I also have some launch rods. Um, our supplier wants to change our launch rods and make them hollow. I don't like hollow rods because they can bend a lot easier than the solid rods. So I'm going to reject those uh, because I don't like them and I know you won't like them either. Um, I also have here on my desk a roll of uh, lip balm. And I noticed this, uh, this cozy that you use to attach it to your jacket in the wintertime. Well, this thing uh, had this cool idea on the uh, altimeter one. Um, it fits almost perfect. Uh, one of the problems with that people have had, oh, there's the phone ringing. I'm going to turn that off here. One of the problems that people have had um, is that their altimeter one whacks around so hard inside the rockets that sometimes the cover can come off. Well, if you put this little cozy on it, it's a little protector, then you can just cut that off. It's a little bit loose, so what I would do is I would just take a little rubber band, just wrap it around the outside just so that it wouldn't slide off. Um, so that's kind of what I, I think about during the day when I'm just kind of staring at things. Over here I have a, a motor retainer uh, from Aeropack. Um, I'm not sure why this is on my desk, but uh, I'm always fondling the rocket parts. Uh, what you can't see in the office is I'm kind of surrounded by rockets. Um, as you know, we build every rocket that we sell here, and they're kind of stacking up, um, the ones that we built. Uh, I try to go out and fly them, and we do destroy a bunch of them. Um, you know, we, we crash a lot more than you do. You, you don't realize it. Uh, you know, it's something that we don't brag about, but uh, we actually do. But uh, they'll come back with scrapes and bruises and broken fins, and uh, we kind of patch them back together and stand them up in the office so that... When people do come by, they have something to look at, and uh, it makes us look so much more professional. Um, here on the wall, I have a uh, picture. Uh, this is an oil painting that was done by Jeff Lane. Uh, he's actually selling this, so if uh, you see it here in the background and you'd like to buy it, uh, he's only selling it for $1,000, which is a pretty good deal. It's been sitting here in my office, and I like it, and every now and then somebody comments on it. Um, what, what's the best part about this job? Well, I would say that it's the technology that I get to see. Like this altimeter one. When I, when I first saw that, I said, man, that's got to be the coolest thing in the last five years. Um, and then, right after that one came out, somebody else called me up and he, he has this GPS altimeter, the, the telemetrum. I said, man, that's the coolest thing in the last five years. Well, that's, that's the cool part of this job, is, is seeing all the, the neat stuff that other people are doing. Um, and I really appreciate it when people tell me about the, this cool stuff. So if you see some, some neat stuff that uh, is new, uh, let me know about it, because I, I really appreciate that. That's, you know, that kind of makes my day. Um, I, I really like seeing it. And if you want to sell it, um, that's, that's really where I can help. Um, one, you know, a rocket company is a rocket company, but where we excel is helping people sell their products. And, uh, and it, it's really cool to help people, you know, fulfill their dreams in their life, too. And that's kind of like w the other thing I like about this job is helping you and other customers learn more about rocketry. Um, I do a lot of education seminars and workshops, and I, I, that stuff I, I really like doing. I wish I could do a lot more of it, 
and maybe someday in the future I'll, I'll be able to. Um, I, I kind of think of myself as a teacher um, that I'm trying to help you become better. Uh, my goal is that one of you out there that's watching this video is going to be the first person to step on Mars. And uh, like Neil Armstrong, uh, when you step out on that the surface of Mars, you could say, hey, Tim Van Milligan at Apogee Components, he, he got me excited about rocketry, and that's why I'm here. So if you do that, please remember me. <laughs> um, but the other thing about being a teacher is that I don't let my students slide. Um, so if you call me up or you email me uh, a question about rocketry, uh, don't expect a quick answer. Um, I have my students work, so they have to find the answer themselves. I'll point you in the right direction, but you're going to have to work. So remember that. It's, you want a quick answer, and I know you want a quick answer, but I'm not always going to give you the quick answer. It's, uh, I'm going to say, okay, go to the website, and it's, you're going to find it here. And I know you're not going to want to do that, but i got to do that because I'm your teacher. So this is Tim Van Mill again. Again, um, normally I do these how-to workshop videos, and if you go to the Apogee website and you go to that link up there that says Downloads, and you scroll down on that, and you look for advanced construction videos, that's normally where we do our, our videos, and that's where they're all archived. Right now, at the at about this taping, I've probably got about 50 videos on how to build rockets better. Um, so go there, check them out, um, and if you like what you see, uh, you know, please tell a friend about us. Um, and also, on this video, I'd like to know what you think about this. Um, so just go down here at the bottom on the, under the comments on the, on the YouTube site. Uh, let us know what you think, and so that other people can also uh, see what you think, too. So thanks for coming by today, and uh, we'll see you next time. This is Tim Van Milligan from Apogee Components. May the winds be light. May the skies be blue, and may all your rockets fly straight and true.